Right, we're on a, a drove now. Droves are everywhere, linking villages, hamlets together over centuries. They've, got, they've put some new grass down here by the look of it. New poles and some clearing. Doing it down, walking along here saves me having to have gone up that big hill. Especially with limited time. But I did manage to get Crook's Peak in. Okay? I did manage to get Crook's Peak. Whether anyone will see some of these videos I'm doing lately, I don't know. I've got, I've really got on with tree. But it's, they're all kept and saved. There's a big, sorry we don't have to go in there, there's a big herd of cows over there, look. See? And you get those um, Cumbrian sheep, they, they did have them for a while here. Cumbrian sheep. Um, with special coats, but I don't know if they've got them anymore. He tried to, he tried having them. He was from Cumbria, and um, he was from Cumbria. So he, he, he did try having them. I do know the name, but I just can't remember it at the moment of the special name of the sheep. But here we go. It's a lovely drove. I actually love walking through here with this avenue of trees. Um, it's been tidied up a lot. People are out walking more, I think. And um, it's a nice, it's a nice walk. This one. Yeah, I can't see them. I can't, what are they called again? Herdwicks. I think they're called Herdwicks. Then I can see one up there, right up in the corner, up on top there. I can see one Herdwick with a brownish type furry woolly coat on. So there's one anyway. Herdwick, that's right, the Cumbrian sheep. Hello, you're waiting for me to pass. I'm not going to do any damage, don't worry. Someone's been. Sort of tidying up here, aren't they? Yes, yeah, one herdwick. I can just see one herdwick at the moment, right in the middle. I'll see if I can zoom in and get a picture. There it is. It's brownie coloured. I wonder if that's woodpecker holes there, or bats, what do you think? I expect wasps have been in there. Could be woodpecker, couldn't it? Oh. Look at you! Hello! You can have some bent lamps? Yeah? I expect you will eventually. Don't get that old ram out here. Yeah. Only one herdwick. Wonder why that is. Yeah, look at you. You might remember me from when you were a lamb. They say sheep don't forget faces. So I would have been. I reckon I'd done this a year ago in the summer. A year ago. Yeah, I did. I did a couple walks out here. Uh, shorter ones, but but I had to bus, so I had to bus. It was that year before, year before Sheila. Not this year, you haven't. This is the first time you've been out here. Oh yeah, first time we've been out here. Yeah, it's just a nice walk. 
there's something nice about going down these old droves. You can sort of imagine the past where the farmers would drive their cattle and herds along here or they would take stuff to market or people would come this way to go to Winscombe for market. Early roads, aren't they really? That's what they are. Early roads. And we haven't had to meet any cows. No. I don't think we will. But they're in there. There was a field I used to cross. There's a new battery. Fresh Charlie charged battery. So it's a lovely scene. I've taken some pictures of these lovely trees and the sun coming through. And the lovely drove which we're leaving. It's a little bit more here as we pass the farmer's house. Some little flowers greeting us as we come through. They're pretty. And of course in the summer along here, like not the summer, spring, he has loads of spring flowers lining all the way along, daffodils and other things. It's really quite pretty. It looks a bit untidy at the moment, but uh, Someone's been along here. Looks like an animal's been along here as well. Well, we did manage to do the, the peak. That's good, Sheila. You've made steady progress. Like I said, I might have to put a spur on at some stage. He's not come to speak. The cows have been along. I've just seen the farmer, but he's gone in. He might not recognise me from before. Got to go back here. Farm dog barking on guard duty, Labrador, I think. Hello, it's all right. Hello, good boy. You doing guard duty? Are oh, yeah? you? You doing guard duty? Yeah, good boy. It's all right. It's all right. See what an effect I have on dogs? You talk to them nicely, a nice soft voice, and praise them. Sometimes it works. He calmed down, didn't he? Caged. Yes, yeah, so the farm I didn't take a picture of the house exactly because the farmer was in there. He he went back in. <laughs> I thought he might have engaged in conversation. He does sometimes. He actually walked me across the field of his once because uh, there were cows and he guided me through them. I remember that. 
and came. He said, you want me to walk you across? I said, oh, yes, please. This was one of the early days, one of the early visits back in time. Well, I've done what I wanted to do, folks, which is I've got to allow really 20 minutes from the time I get to the church of St. James of Less. I think it might be a great, I'm not sure actually. I think it might be St. James Great, I'm not sure. Um, to walk, I have to walk through some streets to get to the bus stop. So, there's somebody coming up across. I've forgotten that route. I'm not going to do that route. Um, oh, some black, blackish sheep there. Don't colour. I don't know what you call them. Sort of like dusty colour. Yeah, I haven't done that route for a while. I know we've got cows in there. So I haven't done it. Yeah, you can see there's a well-defined path. There's some um, Barnwell Hill Fort in the background. Over there, look. Barnwell Hill Fort. I've been under that tree, I had a picnic under it. <sighs> now we go down when we get to the um, the lane, that's when I turn off. No, I'm going to turn off again. I think we'll turn off again now. Maybe that must have somebody. <sighs> 